Here's Johnson Fan Rack Sports with Teddy Atlas analyzing the fight. What you think? Who you think is going to win? What are the keys tomorrow for Marez and Santa Cruz? Uh, I, I like Santa Cruz. I think he's going to win the fight. Um, the key is for look, Santa Cruz going to do his thing. He's a one-dimensional fighter. That's what it is. But it's a pretty good dimension. He comes forward, he throws a lot of punches, he clears the way behind the jam. He's fundamentally pretty solid. Doesn't move his head, but he blocks real well. Uh, always coming at you, but again, behind the jam, clears the way, kind of like a snow plow. That plow clears the way, and then the truck can come behind it. That's what he's going to do. It's up to Morris. He's not going to meet him. He's not going to meet him punch for punch. It's up to Morris, the bigger guy, the stronger guy in my estimation. He's got to hurt Cruz. He's got to hurt him early before he gets too much momentum going up that road. If he can hurt him, and again, hurt him early, he can win. But at the end of the day, I'm picking Santa Cruz. Do you think that um, Morris has to make it like a, into a Mexican style fight and shoot out to have a chance to win? Or do you think his skills will I be good enough to fight? That's going to be in our favor of Santa Cruz. So, uh, yes. Because he gives up his height. He doesn't give a damn about his height. <laughs> and he comes forward and he, he, breaks, you know, he engages you. So I think that Morris really is the more dimensional fighter. You know, he's a little bit more versatile. He can box, he can move legs a little bit, he can counter a little bit, he can do more things. I just don't think he's going to be able to box all night long against the pressure of Santa Cruz. Somewhere along the line, again, say it again, he's going to have to hurt Santa Cruz slow down. Thank you.